This is the grade three math practice test for TN Ready. On this version of the test, this is question number three. And I realize that you can't see the whole question, so that would be a little difficult to do. Lee put 36 plates into four stacks. Each stack has the same number of plates. How many plates did Lee put in each stack? Now, if I'm breaking down a large number into smaller numbers, that's what division is. I'm dividing that large number into parts. So I'm taking this 36 and making four groups. A couple ways you could do it. The way that saves you time is just to do the division. But you could also do this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. So this gives me four groups of one, two, oops, didn't need to make a dot there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So there's nine plates on each stack. So my answer is nine. And it will be nine here, nine here, nine here, and you can count those out. So if you didn't have a plan for your division situation, it's always a good idea to make a picture. Like I love drawing pictures to kill time or just to get myself calm during a test. Sometimes the tea and ready can be very stressful. So just taking a few minutes to make some dots. And I mean, these are the worst plates ever, obviously. And these lines aren't even straight. So I'm not judging whether I can draw well. I'm just saying it's possible to do it that way. Also, of course, you could just do 36 divided by 4, which is 9, which was the easy thing to do. What's the big deal about this question? Number one, you needed to know that when you... Uh, break a larger number into groups than its division, as long as the groups are equal. So, and they say it has the same number of plates. So this is a division question. You had to be able to identify that. And then you need to figure out what your process is for that type of division. If it's the facts, that's awesome. That will help you as you move forward. If it's drawing a picture, don't feel any shame over that. It's no big deal. Do what you need to do to get the correct answer and do your best. If you have to draw a picture for now, that's fine. It's grade three, everybody. You have some time to really get the multiplication division facts going before you move past it forever. So work on it now, but also have a fallback plan and maybe drawing a picture can just ease some of those nerves out and make things a little more smooth for you as you go forward.